minute. Well, Mr. Speaker, today is Rare Disease Day, and it's the reason why I am wearing this special tie given to me by Minnesotan Erica Barnes as part of the Chloe's Fight Rare Disease Foundation's Wear Something Rare campaign. Now, rare disease is generally defined as a condition that affects fewer than 200,000 people, and there are approximately 7,000 different types of rare diseases which impact the health of about 30 million Americans, half of which are children. February 29th, a day which is rare in itself, is also set aside to bring awareness and improve access to treatment and medical representation for people living with the rare disease. It's recognized by over 80 countries around the world. Mr. Speaker, there is more that we can do to help. The House passed the 21st Century Cures Act with strong bipartisan support to help lower barriers to medical innovation and provide critical funding to find cures and treatment for medical afflictions, including rare diseases. So on this rare disease, we raise attention to this issue and the need to continue our work to help those who are suffering from rare diseases. And I yield back. Gentlemen, yields for what purpose?